Say Nigerian know they enjoy Ghana. If you like, turn that go fire you now. No be the video they Ghana so. The video just enter Ghana. The video the train since yesterday. The video they Ghana. Don't allow anybody tell you say Ghana know the seat. Ghana the seat for people who have money. <laughs> you understand? If you are in Nigeria, don't be deceived. Don't see yourself because the video just enter. So you say, hey Ghana, they happen no. They can run. They go Ghana. If you no get money, Ghana is not for you. <laughs> Although some people know, some people will say, let me come to Ghana and try my luck. No. Ghana not be country where you and Nigeria will come try luck. Ghana is not a... If you want to try your luck, go out, go Europe. <laughs> Ghana is not the place where we say, everybody will come to enjoy yourself. Come enjoy yourself. Bring money, come and spend and go back. Yes, that is Ghana. Bring money, come and realize, enjoy yourself and go back. Not the place where you say you come and spend your money. Come and spend your money here. Sorry. Understand? Oh, yeah. What is this deal? Shalom, guys. So, guys, someone was asking me, why do you decide to come to Ghana? Why do a young girl like you decide to come to Ghana and stay, even if it's for vacation or whatever? That Ghana is not um, the perfect country for a young girl like me to travel to or to come and stay. Mind you, this person is someone that have stayed or lived in Ghana for so many years that I can't even count. So I want to ask you, what is wrong with a young girl like me coming to Ghana to stay? Is there anything wrong? And which country do you think that is perfect or best for a young girl to go and stay? Or are young girls no more allowed to travel are we not permitted to travel to any country of our choice to stay anyways that's not my reason of making this video so guys i'm making this video because i know that i've posted um something like this before and then maybe you people didn't take it serious or maybe i myself i was not that serious then but today i'm very serious please i need a ghana husband man yes i want to settle down in ghana mm -hmm. i'm serious so so please i need a mature ghana man a serious intelligent wise hmm? Ghana husband man you know last time I said I needed a boyfriend eh? but now I have decided that it's husband I need no more boyfriend I need a husband that you know I'm still a kid I'm just 18 as you can see yeah so I need a man that will not joke with me, that will not joke with my heart. Because this, my heart, don't chop breakfast from the country that I'm coming from. So I don't want it again. That's why I run to Ghana. Because I feel I will have peace of, I will get my peace of mind here in Ghana. I don't know much about Ghana men. Though, but I heard that Ghana men are good. I also heard that Ghana men are uh, not that good i don't know but there is no place you don't have good and otherwise people so that's why i decided to try my luck in ghana please i don't want to be heartbroken i want peace of mind eh if you know you are serious you will not joke with my heart you will not break my heart you give me peace that i deserve you treat me like a queen that i am huh? please come but you people should not rush the last time that i posted something like this the rushing was too much and you people scared me away now i'm back i need a husband man serious one oh, matured one oh, brilliant smart one oh. but please if you are coming the people that came that last one 
they are too dark. Yes, I know that Ghana people are dark skin. I be yes, but please brighten up small, small. You see me now? Just brighten up small, not too dark. So please help me and share this video, repost this video, so that I can get my peace of mind. This my heart is too soft, eh? It's too soft to be passing through a lot of things. That's why I run to this place because I love Ghana so much. Maybe here is where my peace of mind is hiding. Please hide no more. Come out now. I'm serious. Come. Hmm? Please. Eh? Because I love you guys so much, Ghana people. That's why I decided to settle down here. I think the person that is asking me why I came to Ghana or why I decided to travel to Ghana. Now you know why. It's because I want to come and settle down in Ghana. I came to Ghana to look for my peace of mind. Eh? The other country, they too do for there. For me, oh. But you, you can try. Me, I came to try. You can still go there and try. Eh? Please. If you know you are my peace of mind, come to me. I'm waiting for you. Don't too rush. Don't too rush. Gently. Come. Okay, I love you guys. God bless Ghana. God keep Ghana for me. And God restore everything that has been broken in Ghana. One love. Peace. Shalom. If you are a Ghanaian, just be careful about Nigerian ladies. <laughs> you know, they will not like this one. Yes, they will not like this one. Just be careful, ne? Be careful. That is what I have to tell you. You understand? Just be careful because they have majority of them have nothing to offer. Majority of them, they have nothing to offer. It's not like they don't have anything to offer. Uh -huh. They have something to offer in the lifestyle where they want to live. But they don't have anything to offer to you as a man. No. They will just come to you and collect it from you. They just come and collect. But you would think they love you. They don't love you. I think love. <laughs> think the way Nigerian lady want to live here. Eh? Nigerian lady, majority of them think they don't need husband. They just want to have money. They don't need. That is the new lifestyle of them. I don't